Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Leslie and I'm so glad you're here. Today I'm going to try and declutter two spaces. One will be my linen closet, one will be my file cabinet. Who remembers to declutter their file cabinet? I like to go through once a year and really get rid of old pamphlets or um, like user manuals to things that I no longer have, make sure everything's up to date, old bills for some reason I hang on to, we get rid of those. So let's just start decluttering. All right, I'm gonna put my hair up because that will drive me insane. And I think I wanna start actually, I was gonna start in here but I think I'm going to start in my linen closet because that's where I've got so many extra sheets and blankets. And <laughs> let's chat, shall we? Because I've got some issues. I've saved all of my children's pool towels from when they were like two, three. So I've got Teletubbies, Blue's Clues, Bear in the Big Blue House, Unicorns. They don't want those. Get rid of them. Okay. <laughs> That's great. We're going to need a little more coffee. Let's just go over here and make some coffee. All right. Are you ready? Mm, it ain't pretty, but it's going to be. Let's go. All right, so I'm trying to make the lighting as good as I possibly can. Um, I'm going to raise you up. Pretty sure that's a praise and worship song. <laughs> See, I have these dollar store baskets that I labeled. Spring sheets, fall sheets, winter sheets, summer sheets. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We have sheets down here. <laughs> we have a pillow cover and I guess these are sheets. We might have sheets for the bed that I don't even have anymore. So, we have a couple of flat pillows. In case we have guests that need pillows. But we're going to throw these out. Because nobody wants flat pillows. So, I'm going to have a trash pile, a keep pile, and a goodwill pile. If you can give stuff to the Goodwill, I guess you can, right? Alright, I know that this is from the old bed. We don't need that. That's a size twin, top or bottom. That tells me nothing. We're going to get rid of it, because we don't know. This we're going to get rid of, or trash, really. I don't know. Does Goodwill take sheets? Do they want sheets? Do people want other people? I wouldn't want so many extra sheets. We're going to trash them. Okay. That's trash. Been looking for that. But those I think I already threw out. Well, I have one of my Halloween napkins up here. White pillowcases, black, all right, so all of this can go, definitely, I think I threw out these sheets, these were my fall sheets, but they got so pilled, it was like sleeping on sandpaper, so that's going, need to think about these sheets. I need to think about my flannel sheets. I have some 
washcloths from my sister when she comes to visit because she's stuck in 1972 and wants to wash her face with a washcloth. I don't do that. All right. Okay, look. I have a Christmas mat in here. Mm, no. That will go to the Goodwill. That will go to the trash. It's kind of dirty. It, yeah. Trash. Here's all my bags to clean. <laughs> to clean the kitty litter with. We want those. Here's some more. Here's this. T-Mobile Tuesdays. Why do I have this in there? Well, why? Probably got it at the fair. We don't even know. Trash. Here are the tags that I had on the... Um, whatever these things are called to label. Master Sheets, Spring. Guest Bath Towels. Mm. Okay. We'll keep those because we might use that. Here's my fan cleaner. My fan cleaner needs to be replaced because it's dirty. All right. Oh, uh, this is a Yankee candle. Um, you put it on your... I have to change mine, by the way. You put it on your air filter, and it's supposed to make your house smell good. Done work. Don't fall for it. Wasted my money on that. So, whatever. And that. There's some more bags. To clean the kitty litter. another bag. There's another bag and another bag and another bag. All right, so I have, oh, okay. This is a gray duvet cover. We might let that go because I'd rather go more with a, a yeah, I don't know. Here's my clean and new one, so we'll replace this one. See, y'all were all freaking out thinking I had dirty stuff in my house. We throw it away and we get a new one. Maybe. Oh, we have to take the plastic out. <laughs> There we go. And then you just put it through your fan. And it is fan. Fantastic. Alright, I have a soap pillowcase because I thought, you know, I needed it. And we don't need it. I have some more tags. Master bath towels. Master sheets winter. Goes over there. Okay, then Master Sheets Summer. Alrighty then. I know that I will keep these, so these are a keep. Um, there's there. This is a towel that could actually go over here. All right. Done. I'm sure some sheets came in it. And I said, oh yeah, I'm going to put the sheets right back in there and make it easy 
the store there. <laughs> but we're gonna keep, should we keep it? I mean, it could hold things. What would I want to put in it? What do I need it for? Probably nothing, trash it. All right. Um, I'm going to put all of the towels right there. We have a lot of towels we're gonna go through and see which ones we really need. If they've got tears and rips in them like this one somewhere. Yeah, that's going. Okay. Put them down there for now. These are a pillow cover that I got when I said, oh yes, I'm going to change out my pillow covers for the seasons. Pretty sure that can go. This is to a set of sheets we're not sure about. This is another silk can go. See? Okay, well this one's mine. This one's mine. I will be keeping this one. This is my daughter's from when she was about 15, 16. She's now 30, going to be 31 this year. We don't need that. all of the sheets on my bed because I want to fold them neatly and get them back in here. So, I'm going to grab these and these that we know we want to keep. And then here. another empty one. This one says Master Sheets Fall. That's fantastic. Alright, we have another towel. Looks like it's in good condition. And this that goes to those. We, we have a random sock! So it looks like I need to replace my bins because they're pretty messed up. This is my summertime, it's my summertime um, quilt that I use. So I'm going to keep that. I'm going to put it on my bed to I am curious to know where my new white sheets are that were just fantastic. I'm pretty sure these are the, they were my David Bitten ones. These might be the pillowcases, doesn't look like it because they had David Bitten on them. They might be in my closet. We don't know. Pool and beach towels. Okay, another one of these. I still have this shower curtain because I love it. So I'm not going to get rid of that because I might want to use it. This is a nautical themed that can go. This is a
Oh, this is We Are, You Are, Spring Fest. And it was a pirate theme. I used to have it in my, <laughs> in my blue car because my blue car had leather seats, real leather seats. And I used to protect it from skin oils and from sticking and doing all of that. So, we'll keep that one and my Yorkie one. It's got Yorkie puppies all over it. My niece is probably going to move out of her home this year. So, no more pool unless I sign up for the local one here. We got to we got to get past the staying uh, car insurance. Once I uh, emptied all of the sheets and towels, I put them on my bed, or the sheets at least, and now I'm going through talking nonsense about something. Uh, the dog is attacking me. And I decided to take my Halloween-themed sheets and put them in my closet with my Halloween decor. And I think that's where I've got a lot of my sheets, because I know I have some for 4th of July, some for the spring. Yeah, it's a problem. So I'm just going through folding, deciding what I want, what I don't want, and just putting them in piles. Keep, don't keep, all of that. And then what I'm deciding to keep, we're going to put back into the bins. Let me know what you think about the bin system. Does it look neat and cohesive? Should I take items out of the bins? I keep them in there because as you see right now, I do not know how to fold a fitted sheet for the life of me. Never have been able to do it and it looks messy. That's why I use these various bins. So what do you think? All right, so here's what it looks like now. I just have my bags down there for the kitty litter, seasonal towels and things in there. I left these out of bins because it's just easier to grab them and put them away. Then we have the winter and fall. Um, I have one set of flannels in here. And I have one set of brown in here. All of my seasonal sheets are in the bins in my closet. So my Christmas sheets are going to go in my closet. My Halloween and Thanksgiving will go in my closet. We then have summer. My 4th of July sheets are in my closet. And spring. I don't know if I have anything in summer. Yes, I do. I have that gray. I'm looking for my white David Bitten ones. Spring has that greenish gray. I only have two pool towels. And then I have that. So that's been decluttered. Much better. Let me know if I should put those towels into a bin as well. I would like to replace the bins that are kind of misshapen because that's yeah. But guess what we do? <laughs> I don't see anything. Do you see anything? No.
right, so now that I have a nice clean floor, <laughs> we're going to take my file cabinet and pull everything out of it, sit in the floor, figure out what I need and what I don't need, and just declutter it. This is one of those spaces, maybe you haven't thought about it, I don't know. But this is one of my favorite spaces to declutter because I come across memories. <laughs> and Some good, some bad. But then it's also a way to really feel like you're decluttering. Because you're getting rid of a bunch of junk that you don't need. I brought in my shredder so that I can shred any financial documents or personal documents that I wouldn't want anybody to have any information. It looks like it's pretty full, so I'm going to empty it out into my craft room trash can and set it up, get it ready for the first batch of documents. A little picture of my baby boy. He was probably three years old. And we were in church, and they said, let us pray. And that little sweet baby put his head down and prayed. Oh, I love him. Him's trying to be a silly boy. In that picture. 2005. He was four years old. Come on, what time to meet? Here's a picture of me and my dad. In 95, look at my hair. I had my whale shirt on. I was skinny. <laughs> Alright. Cricut Easy Press 2, don't need. Cricut Explore Air 2, don't need. Cricut Maker gave it to my daughter. Thank you. That's a pound gone. Sticker paper needs to go into my box with sticker paper. Over there. Register your Gemini Junior is trash. Trash. A lot. <laughs> Here's everything from my house. This is my fireplace that I put together. That's downstairs. I kept the instructions on how to put that together. HP Desk Jet 3630. I don't even think I have that one anymore. No, I don't. Okay, trash. This is trash. This is... Oh, it's falling apart. Hold on. Because I've got to read it to you. <clears throat> we had the big, the big paper with the big lines on it like that to write on when we were in kindergarten, first grade, whatever. Oh, this is a turkey. Okay, this is me saying that that's Mr. Turkey. T-U-R-K-Y. Uh, Mr. Let's see what Mr. Turkey's up to. Oh, no. Leslie, November 13th, 1974. I know, I know, I know the amount of issues, but it's cool. Here is a duck. And then I drew a duck. Is this a duck? Here is a duck. Is this a duck? 1974, 60. So I would have been in first grade. Here is Ted. Here is Bill. Here is Jill. Here is a duck. Here is Ben. Leslie, November 14th, 1974. We had to do these every day. I remember this. 
two, this was Miss Chapel, my first grade teacher. Her name was Miss Chapel, and she drove a pink Cadillac, like um, that old kind, like the 60s, I guess it was. Yeah, I remember all that. And we used to go to Jack in the Box every once in a while. Not the teacher and I, but whatever. Good morning, one day. I, one day, period. I saw a duck with feathers on his back. I said, good morning. And he said, quack, quack. Leslie, 2 plus 1 is 3. 3 minus 0 is 3. 1 plus 1 is 2. And 2 minus 1 is 1. <laughs> and 0 plus 1 is 1. And 0 minus 1 is 0. Oh, 1 minus 1 is 0. 1, min one plus 0 is... I must have written them wrong because she marked them wrong, but whatever. <clears throat> the next day I said, here's Ben. Is Ben here? Here's Bill. Is Bill here? Let's just look at the drawings and the writings. Okay. These are the things that I saved. Okay, we're going to put this back together now. We're going to put it... My mother saved them, so I saved them after she passed. E is for, we have no idea. D is for, I would imagine my dad, he was my favorite person. Excuse me, AI, we're right here. T is for trailer. Truck, we don't know. I don't know why she checked it right if we don't even know what it is. Oh, look, she much better. Keep up the good work. I was writing much better. This is a red. This is a five. This is a purple. This is a six. Okay. okay. And we're done. We're done decluttering. I got rid of a lot of papers. I got a good amount, about half filled with these. That's it. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this video. I'm going to continue on with the decluttering, but I'm going to end this video right here. I hope this motivated you to pull out a drawer, some files, whatever. Declutter with me. Let's get it going. We don't need extra pounds of stuff in our homes, just taking up space. We just need love from the Bobo Bear. Yes, we do. The Bobo Bear. Alright guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.